All right, so I want you to think about this problem. The entrance to a state park costs $6 per vehicle and $2 per person in the vehicle. You're gonna reason through this table. Think about how much it would cost for a car with two people to enter the park, how much it would cost for four people and 10 people. I want you to record your thinking in the table and I wanna see all the math that you're doing. I wanna see that evidenced in the table. And then I would like you to try to answer number two and number three and number four. So I'm gonna give you like five or so minutes of quiet think time. Then we're gonna break into partners, turn and talk with partners and kind of reason through this and then we'll solidify this understanding and synthesize whole group. All right, let's go. And um, for every person in the car, it's $2. So two times uh, two is four. Um, plus six, that's $10 in total. Yeah, I agree. So I got 10 as well. And um, for the next one, I got Yes, I got fourteen dollars. Also, all right, and because it's um two dollars for every one person, so four times two is eight. Yes. Plus the six dollars is fourteen. And then yeah, that's what. I, that's what. Did I, you agree or disagree with her? We well, we're kind of talking about how. You see, I did a multiplication problem for each of these. Okay, how did you get this number right here? Um, I kind of just asked myself two times y equals ten for, and like okay. for each of them, I kind of did that, and also that's how I was able to figure out the price for each of them. I wasn't necessarily doing. So you thought it was two sixty, or uh, what did you think the price was? Um, I think the pri I wasn't finished with the. You were done with that one. Okay. Can we switch over to somebody else in your group and what you thought about that? Okay. So I thought since there's six dollars for each car, I added the six dollars and then I multiplied it by two because that's how much each person is for one person. Okay, can you repeat that one more time? Okay, so I added six dollars for every like thing because you have for one car and then I multiplied however many people were in the car by two because that's how much they have to pay each. Okay, what where were you at with this? Do you, what do you think about the two different ways that this was done? Um are you still I, thinking I, about it? I agree with Taya because um yeah, it says it's it's um sorry uh it's okay it says it's um two do two dollars per person in the vehicle but it also has to be the um the cost of the vehicle one if each person in the vehicle wait uh oh okay so in this how much will each person pay what did you get I got like a lot of answers because it said for each row. So I did each row in the table. What do you mean you got oh, different answers for I each row? Four. Can you tell me more about that? So when it so, so, so says each row in the table, okay. I decided to divide it, um, divide the entrance di um, by how many people are in the vehicle. Okay. So for the first row, I got five. For the second row, I couldn't get an answer, so I. Um, did the calc I think I did the calculations correct and got three dollars and two cents and I was kind of confused for the third row so I don't exactly know if the answer is right okay how did you get 26 in that third row so two people per person um, in the vehicle so 10 times 2 is 20 plus the entrance fee is six dollars so I got 26 Sure, yeah. So I so I was doing every car has six dollars, but what's the six dollar fee? The six dollar fee is per vehicle. Per vehicle. And each person has to pay two dollars. So two times two four plus six is what I was thinking. Raise your hand if you and your partner differed in how you approached the problem and had different answers in your table. Raise your hand. Okay, hands down. Raise your hand if raise your hand if your partner was able to explain their process and that helped you revise your own thinking. Raise your hand if you're still confused. <laughs> That's okay. Let's work on it together. Uh, I said that for uh, the when more people are in the vehicle, the unit rate gets smaller. Excellent. Um, the more people that are in the car, the less each of them have to pay. 
to by even though the vehicle like total entrance cost is increasing there's more people to like divide it by okay so the per person cost is what going lower yes 